Well, one has to stress that these are unconfirmed reports, but it seems that in the latest uh, development, investigators are making progress. It does indeed seem as if investigators have found that several perpetrators uh, attempted to murder Sergei Alunia Skripal. Sergei Skripal, uh, a former Russian spy, and his daughter who was visiting him uh, from Moscow, Yulia. That was back in early March. Now, as I said, these are unconfirmed uh, reports. They are being uh, given by the Press Association. But what is interesting is that this, uh, again, this source uh, says that these perpetrators are sure to be Russian. How and why? Well, apparently investigators, after trawling through 5,000 hours of CCTV, have cross-checked this with people entering the United Kingdom and leaving shortly before and shortly after this attempted murder of the Skripals. Uh, and this is where this information comes from. So this is, if indeed this is true, then this would uh, show that this is a professional attack, say, uh, analysts, against uh, Sergei Skripal. Of course, we should point out that Sergei Skripal and his daughter both survived after being in a coma and then critically ill, uh, but they have survived. They were discharged from Salisbury Hospital uh, some time ago and are at undisclosed locations, we believe, still in the United Kingdom. Uh, but then you'll remember that on the 30th of June, two British nationals, a man and a woman, were taken uh, very seriously ill. They too, uh, say British authorities and say police, that is confirmed, were poisoned by Novichok. We don't know if it's the same batch. Police do believe the two attacks are linked. Uh, the woman did not survive, so she is the first person to die on British soil from this nerve agent attack, uh, this first nerve attack, uh, agent attack since the end of the Second World War. Uh, and the man is fighting for his life, uh, basically, uh, in Salisbury Hospital, but possibly expected uh, to survive. It was the woman who was more uh, badly uh, poisoned. And it seems that it, this was with a bottle that she or he found, possibly a perfume bottle. Benedict, uh, any reaction from Russia yet to these uh, reports of police identifying several Russians as suspects uh, in the attack? Yes, the reaction was swift. And uh, back from holiday, the Russian ambassador to the United Kingdom, uh, Alexander Yakovenko, uh, said to British media, unfortunately, we don't have an official statement, he says, of the British side. He wants to hear from Scotland Yard or from the Foreign Office. He says there are lots of versions uh, that they're hearing from the media, uh, both here in the UK and internationally and in newspapers. But he says they are not supported from the Foreign Office. As yet, the Met Police and Scotland Yard are refusing to discuss this, refusing to confirm this Press Association uh, report. So we will have to wait uh, and see if this is indeed uh, confirmed.